In today's video, boys, we go ahead and check out the new Future Stars SPC card for Claudia Pina. Pina is a 90 rated card. She has high medium work rates, right footed with four star skill moves and five star weak foot. Now we do see a bit of versatility with the card as well, which is always great to see. She can play the center attacking mid, center mid, and left wing positions. Now boys, if we go ahead and look at her in-game stats in a bit more detail, man, we can see that the card has the potential to be really OP in-game. She does have 86 pace with 86 acceleration and 86 sprint speed. Pretty decent right there, but you definitely need a chemistry style to make her even more quick in game 90 shooting an absolutely phenomenal stat boys 91 attacking positioning 95 finishing and 90 shot power should be extremely clinical in game now if you do want to go ahead and play her as a center attacking mid the 87 passing probably is going to be enough 90 vision 90 short pass and 81 long pass 89 dribbling for the card boys is a very solid stat now keep in mind she is only five foot five 89 agility 91 balance and 92 reaction should be very quick and swift on the ball and then last but not least boys 74 physical and okay stat she does have 82 stamina which is pretty decent not the greatest of strength and aggression but she isn't that type of player if we jump on over to footman boys we can see that pina does have seven different play styles we have a double play style plus incisive pass and finesse shot she also has the ping pass tiki taka technical flair and trivella so a lot of really solid play styles for the card now when it comes to chemistry styles i think that the best option for the card especially if you do want to go ahead and use her in a very advanced position is probably the hunter now with the hunter chem style she's going to have a really nice pace upgrade she's going to have 94 pace with 94 acceleration and 94 sprint speed and she's also going to have 94 shooting 95 attacking positioning 99 finishing and 94 shot power now another chemistry style that could be a pretty solid option for the card is also the engine it's really going to help out with their passing and dribbling as well with the engine we're not getting the same pace boost but she is still going to be very quick with 90 pace overall she's also going to have 92 passing so very important if you do want to go ahead and play her as a center attacking mid and then she's also going to have 93 dribbling boys 93 agility 99 balance and 97 dribbling as that subcategory now if we go ahead and look at this little chart right here with the hunter chem style she does become a 92 rate to center forward so that's going to be very interesting to test out in game as always boys if you guys do enjoy these fc24 player reviews go ahead and do me a huge favor if you guys can leave a like on today's video and also consider subscribing to the channel if you are new it would be greatly appreciated this is a team we're going to be using in foot champions to test out the new pina card we're going to be playing her at the center forward position in the 4-3-2-1 formation so without further ado boys let's go ahead and jump into game number one and let's see how good this card really is all right boys here we are jumping into game number one and i must say man i'm really excited for the future stars promo we're coming up against vintage Toure, Zaha, Holland, Mbappe, Sissoko, a very interesting team. But yeah, man, what could potentially be the best promo of the year is finally here, boys. And we're kicking things off with Claudia Pina, man. I think she's going to be really solid in game. All right, boys, first things first. Let's go ahead and test out the cards dribbling. Should be very quick and swift on the ball. We gave her a hunter, so no extra dribbling. And as you guys can see, man, the left stick dribbling, very good. Good ball control right there. Nice, one more. Now, we could spring into a counterattack. Now, with the hunter chem style, she should be very quick. So we can go ahead and test out her sprint speed a little bit. And for the most part, she is very quick. We'll go for a finesse shot. Ooh, it's a decent attempt, boys. Okay, nice early start. That's a good tackle, man. She is very, very aggressive. R1 dribbling right here. Keeps it very close. We'll go near post. Why not? It's a decent attempt. Ball roll. Finesse shot. Claudia Pina is just wide, boys. You can definitely tell that they kind of nursed the finesse shot a little bit. But it seems to still be a very big threat. Right, we got to go for a team press, man. Nothing's really happening at the moment. Socrates, nice. Pina, very good attacking positioning. Five-star weak foot. It's a lovely finish, man. I think she's going to pick up really good areas, convert a lot of chances. That's a good finish. Pina, nice little touch right there. Now, I do think that she's probably best suited as like a center attacking mid and like a narrow formation. Good dribbling right there. Good sprint speed as well. The cutback was phenomenal. How we're not scoring right there, I don't know. But she is definitely a playmaker. Bruno, that's a good tackle. Pina, come on. Ball roll. Finesse shot. Claudia Pina. That's what I'm talking about, boys. What a finish that is. That's more like it. So her long shots are definitely a huge part to her game. If you want to play her as like a left-sided center forward or at the left wing position, you definitely can. Pina, good control right there. The first touch, man, and the ball control in general is very nice. Good sprint speed right there. Gets away from Zambrata. Pina, ball roll. Left stick dribbling. Keeps it in. If we would have went to ground right there, we would have gotten a penalty, but we don't. Pina, cut back. Ooh, it's not a great ball. All right, boys. Into the second half we go. Pina masterclass right here. R1 dribbling. It's good, boys. Very good on the ball. All the way. I will say, man, she dodges a lot of tackles as well. Nice. Good tackle right there. I might try to maybe get someone in behind just to test out her passing a little bit. Socrates has made a great run. Lovely over the top through ball as well. 
That's a lovely team play, man. Pino with a really good pass. And I think that's something that's going to be huge for the card, man. Her passing. Her passing has to be really good. We could maybe spring into a counterattack right here. I'm not too sure if my opponent is going to rage quit. He has paused it. Swing it. Okafort, nice. Pina almost playing like a striker. Step over is good. Ball roll Trivella. She's very clinical, man. I will say the finishing in and around the box is really nice. I will say if you want to maybe play her as like a center attacking mid, I'd probably go with the engine. Pina. Inverted Trivella. That's a goal. That's a goal, man. Her long shots are very, very good. Lovely finish again. All right, boys. Here we are jumping into game number two. And so far, so good. We're coming up against a much better team. Pirlo Eusebio Di Natale. He does have Allison in goal as well. Cantona. But yeah, boys. As you guys probably already know, in order to complete the SBC, it is both an 87 and an 85 rated team. For the value, man, I think it's great value. I think she's just one of those players that work really well this year in FC24 when it comes to like her dribbling and stuff like that. So for me, it's a WSBC. One more, one more, one more. She's onside. Pina. Good dribbling right there. Good sprint speed as well. We'll look for the cutback. It's a lovely assist, man. Like I said, she can get you a lot of assists, whether you play her as a center attacking mid or center forward. Nice little touch. The sprint speed, boys. Not half bad. Gets around Van Dyke very easily. Go for a little finesse shot. It's a good save by Allison. Probably should be scoring right there, though. One more. Pina. Oh, the step over was good. I don't know if he got a touch to it, but that's some decent strength holding off Marquisio. Ball roll Trivella. Oh, a bit central, boys, but another great attempt. Bonmari. Pina almost playing like a striker. The turn was good. Finesse shot. She's clinical, man. I must say the finishing in and around the box. Very, very clinical player. She can get you a lot of assists. She can also get you a lot of goals as well. It's good, man. The technical play style, very effective. Pina all the way. Drop the shoulder. Now, I will say, man, if you want her to be more quick and swift, I do recommend the engine, especially as, like, a center attacking mid. She's good, but she isn't, like, the quickest. About to call a little bit of space. Pina, first time pass. It's a lovely ball, boys. The passing so far has been really good. How we choked that, I don't know, man. I thought he was just going to keep moving his goalkeeper. But, again, the passing, incredible. Good pressure. Got a little bit of space with Pina. Good. Now, she does have five-star weak foot, but we'll go near post because he's going to move his goalkeeper, man. Come on, good attacking positioning, a good finish as well. The five-star weak foot is a huge part to her game as well because you don't have to force it onto her right. You can definitely use her left as well. Pina, good hold up play. We go for an over-top through ball. It's a really good ball, man. I don't know, but her passing is just way too good in game. Go for it. <laughs> Round of applause, boys. What a play that is. It was a lovely over-the-top through ball to start with. As a center attacking mid, man, I think that she could be so, so good. That's good, boys. Come on. Come on, boys. Pina. I usually say the man of the hour, but now the lady of the hour. The touch. Oh, I will say, man, like in a very advanced position, she definitely is going to be bullied off of the ball. Especially against like VVD, Blanc players like that. So definitely keep that in mind. Oh, boys, we got a free kick to end it. We have a free kick to end things. Pina. Can we find the back of the net? I'm telling you, boys, I've been practicing on my free kicks a little bit. That's a good finish. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That is us using the new Future Stars Claudia Pina SBC in a few games of Foot Champions. And to be completely honest, man, a really solid SBC. Now, in order to complete the SBC, it is both an 85 and an 87 rated team. So you're looking at around 200,000 coins, which, in my personal opinion, is some pretty decent value. If we go ahead and dissect her in-game stats in a bit more detail, the 86 pace. Now, with the Hunter Kemp style, she does have 94 pace overall. And for the most part, boys, she was quite quick in-game. I think that her... Her sprint speed is a lot better than her acceleration. 90 shooting, a phenomenal stat, man. The finishing in and around the box, and then also her long shots, really, really clinical. Now, if you do want to go ahead and play her as a center attacking mid in game, I think her 87 passing is really solid as well. 90 vision, 90 short pass, very accurate in game. 89 dribbling for the most part was a very good stat as well. With her being only five foot five, she was very quick and swift on the ball. But I do recommend if you do want to go ahead and play her as a center attacking mid in game to probably give her the engine to make her even more quick and even better on the ball. And then last but not at least boys 74 physical for the card i'm not gonna lie the stamina is okay and she isn't the strongest on the ball if you do want to go ahead and play her in a very advanced position let's say like the center forward position she probably will be bullied off the ball quite easily and then i do also want to go ahead and mention man the double play style plus she does have some really nice play styles that are really going to help with her game and overall i just think she's one of those players that work really well this year in fc24 you know smaller more intricate very good dribbling very good passing and finishing and for 200 000 coins i do think it is a wsbc and i would highly recommend you guys go ahead 
ahead and complete it if you haven't already. But that is going to be the end of today's video. If you guys did enjoy it, let me know by leaving a like, comment down below what player you guys would like to see next in another player review. And then also consider subscribing to the channel if you are new boys. It would be greatly appreciated. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for clicking on today's video. I've been your boy Bullbat. I'll catch you guys in another one very, very soon. Peace.